All right, dude. So here's your machine, man. This has uh, it has Galaga. It does have the Miss Pac-Man Galaga Frogger logos up top. It has uh, Miss Pac-Man on this side. It has all four logos, and we'll change this guy to the Miss Pac-Man Galaga cross. Uh, back and forth, cross, cross, uh, cross from each other. And what I was going to do is show you guys, show you what this, what the little box was that I was telling you about. So we have all these connections connected to this one little box. And what this thing does is that it shows you to VGA switch. It shows you button one, button two, VGA one, VGA two. So VGA one has the big board. So that's this guy. It's a whole computer system in there. And that guy has 2,100 games. It actually has a lot more games. I'll show you that in a second. So if you press this button here on the right side, you go from one screen, I'm going to press it now, to the other screen. And it just automatically just shoots it head to head. So now you can see the 412 head to head. So now you can play uh, across from each other. So it's really cool. And it has the two control panels, one on each side. So, so there's that guy. And I'm gonna I'm gonna change it back. All you gotta do is just press this little button. And I did notice that the uh, this system here does not have volume control. So what I'll do is uh, this monitor does not have the mo volume control. It, it's just a, a direct monitor that turns on with the system. So it doesn't have a remote. What we're gonna do is change out the monitor and change out the top graphic for you, so you can get that Miss Pac-Man Galaga you like. So we'll get that ready and uh, we'll ship it out after it's done. So that's about it, man. That's all we're going to have to do, do to it. And uh, you should be able to have uh, straight audio and everything out of that guy. And, uh, oh, audio, obviously. And be able to control it. So that'll be kind of cool. So anyway, there's your machine, man. Do a little walk around here. It's the back end. Oh, and I have the door here, the front door. It's right here. We got, we got our, our shop here. You can see some of the stuff we have here. Some of the pins, some of the arcades, and uh, it just keeps going back there, man. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this guy, this is your, your front door. It has a lock set up for it. So all we have to do is just slide this guy in here. We slide it in. We put the door on. And whoop. I gotta. It's kind of hard to do it by with one hand while I'm trying to record. But yeah, we just put it in, man. Pretty much. Pretty much slide it in, slide it in, lock it, and you're good. So there it is, dude. We also have a little uh, a little sticker here on the side. It has our our phone number and our our uh, website there. So if you have any uh, any questions, just you could always call us there. You always have a tag or something that they could uh, refer back to us with. So anyway, hope you like it, man. And uh, yeah, oh. I'll show you some of the gameplay. I'm sorry. <laughs> some of the um, stuff up top. The favorites. Game 1 of 3,002 games. And it keeps going. Game 1 of 315. So these are all like uh, just lists. Vector. So you have like asteroids and all that stuff in there. Fighter games. Shooting games. You got laser games. There's is is some trackball games. We don't have a trackball, but it's, you can play some games with the joystick. And so this is a mega mega list. It has 17,810 games, dude. So and it has a lot of stuff. Again, it takes a little while to get to the to the through the games, but all you gotta do is move this guy left and right, and you should be golden, man. You can get um, get to where you have to be quick. And uh, there's a lot of games though. <laughs> if you wanna wanna go for a smaller list, uh, you go to the 3102 or the 1300. And it's a little faster to get through the games and find specific games you like. So that should work out. This does a lot, a lot of like the Asteroids, Asteroids Deluxe. What's nice is that you get a little video shot of what is going on in each game. So that way you're not, you don't have to jump in a game and be like, oh, crap, that's not what I wanted. Another feature that we have on this guy is that you can jump out of a game. You don't necessarily have to turn the entire machine off to try to get to a different game. What you do is you take, you hold the start button and you, ho you hold this guy for five seconds. And it automatically jumps out and goes to another game. So that's kind of neat. Um, I'm going to get uh, to a game here really quick. We'll play um, Galaga 88. How about that? So there it is. And you have a little coin button here. 
All you do is press this guy. Press that and there we go, man. And this kind of loud right now. <laughs> there you get some, some of the gameplay. I'm going to press the start button to jump out. That thing's loud, man. The um, so yeah so the, the, again we gotta we gotta mess with the sound here, add that sound uh, sound system to it and we should be golden man. Um, this guy we're gonna, we're gonna change the monitor and the top gla the top graphics so we should be all right. Uh, but yeah this thing has all the games you could possibly imagine it just keeps going and going and going. I know you wanted wanted to see the Mortal Kombat's Mario Brothers you got Mario Brothers the original so that's kind of neat, and then you go to the, I'm going to go to LMNOP. Oh, I just passed it up, dang it. The Mortal Kombat's are right here, dude. So you got Mortal Kombat 1, you got Mortal Kombat 2, and Mortal Kombat 3. So that's kind of awesome, dude. You have all, all three of them in, the, in one system. And I'll, I'll start that up, actually. Let's get that guy going. It's going to be loud. <laughs> the volume control is inside, so i got to mess with it. Insert coin. Press the start button. Then you have uh, the scorpion here. Probably should have got somebody else. So, and this is the actual gameplay. So, get. and if you remember, Mortal Kombat 2 only used five buttons. Unlike Street Fighter, they uses all six. Mortal Kombat only uses the top five. These four and the top one. This guy is, is not, not in service when you're playing Mortal Kombat. Only when you're playing uh, Street Fighter. So there you have it, man. Um, if you have any questions, let me know, dude. I have a couple uh, couple things we're going to do to this thing to make it, make it a little better and easier to use. And this, this was actually a machine we were going to use for just a, a floor model so we could have it on all the time. So I think the, I think the monitor, monitor that we used here was going to be um, something that we, were just, we just tossed in there. So this is going to be same size monitor. It's a 24-inch LED. And to give you an idea how big it is, this thing is it's 32 inches tall. It's 24 inches wide, for, uh, 22 inches wide at the top, 27 inches wide from back to the front of the control panel. And it's 36 inches from this, this side of the control panel to the other side. So it's 36 inches from in length. So 27 wide, 36 long, 32 tall. So there you go, man.